Hello to all my beautiful people. I hope that everyone is having a fabulous Sunday so far. I wanted to jump on here and just give you a little bit of context to this week's uh, vlog, which I started filming on July 3rd, so last Friday, and you're going to be able to see what I did during 4th of July weekend. You're going to be able to see also me just processing orders all week and like ups and downs that I've had throughout this week. Towards the end of the vlog, I share with you new meaningful pieces that I have added to my jewelry collection and I share with you tips that every girl should know before they buy a jewelry piece. The week started with negative Betty, which you're going to meet her pretty soon. So I hope that I'm going to stop rambling and I am going to just let you guys watch this vlog. I hope that you enjoy it. Hello everyone. This is negative Betty reporting live from Miami, Florida, where it's 105 degrees today and humidity level is at 80%. It's a very hot day today. And they have just announced that the beaches are closed for the weekend. So we have decided to take out the boat today. We are going to just go out on the boat, into the ocean, jump in and hopefully have a wonderful weekend. <laughs> even though we never really use this. Right now, this is just where we're keeping everything. We got some ribs, we have sandwiches. I got my laptop just in case I need to do something really quick. Um, I need to be online. This is all my stuff. This is cooler, snorkels. the other side you have the moon look at the moon so our battery died and we got stranded and this is the rescue that came to tow us away exactly <laughs> Good morning and happy 4th of July! This is where I woke up today. It's a little bit cloudy in Miami today. And um, hi, I'm just kind of like doing my makeup because last minute, last night, they decided yesterday in the afternoon, they announced that there was gonna be lockdown in Miami at 10 p.m. And we actually went out on the boat all day. And oof, where can I put you? Because I need to do my makeup. Um, we actually went out on the boat all day yesterday and then we the battery died and we had to be towed into back into land and that was like 9 45 p.m and then when we got all off the boat the easiest closest house to go to was jonah's house which is where i am now uh, my friend jonas um with the sleeves i'll introduce you to him later uh, so yeah I mean, I slept here and another friend of ours slept here and now I'm basically just getting my face ready, pre makeup on because we are gonna go have, we're gonna do a 4th of July little dinner with um, Tadine because it's also Tadine's birthday weekend. So right now I'm just gonna get ready and then we're gonna get go and head over there. Uh, there's lockdown today as well. So right now it's about 2 p.m. So I just gotta like, do my makeup and then go buy meat and all that stuff and then just have like a really nice like 4th of July and it looks like it's gonna rain today but whatever it is what it is I'm just gonna put you here while I do my makeup since I was in the bathroom so I did my makeup rushed around went to the supermarket got everything made it back here to Tadine's house look at this beautiful view I have 
all my friends that are here and I am just gonna take you around so you guys can see what we're doing well you know you have Jonas in the stove Jonas? Yes. Happy 4th? Happy 4th. What are we making? I mean, what are you making, um, obviously? Starting with the desserts, <laughs> which is the sausage, and then we're going to have the main course here, which is the beef. And we have some fish for the vegetarians here. Yes. Fish here. Uh, I love red onions, as you can see. I'm going to have to put you on my vlog this time. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, so happy 4th of July, everyone. Um, Monday everyone. I hope that everyone had a fabulous 4th of July weekend. As you guys saw my 4th of July, I was just having just a very simple but um, cozy lunch with friends and just being grateful for being part of this amazing country that despite everything that's going on, we are free and we have the opportunity to work on our dreams and everything here is possible so i didn't vlog on sunday because i had somewhat of a rocky sunday but today is monday and i wanted to just give you a little bit of insight i'm going to be packing all the orders that i received over the weekend obviously a lot of you ordered earrings and necklaces as you guys know the necklaces take three weeks to produce but the earrings are here and are ready to ship out so i woke up really early today in the morning i've been packing all morning and now i'm just down to the last couple of packages and i just wanted to show you how i am doing what i would be doing in my logistics center how i am doing this at home i'm actually packaging each and every single one of your orders myself so let me show you so I have set up shop in this living room and basically I'm going to show you. So these are the packages that are ready to ship out. These need to be dropped off at the post office. This is what's in progress. This is my station where I lay out everything that I have to ship out. This is where we cut off the stickers. Well, let me just come here and show you. So starting first off, First off, we are here in this station. This uh, station right here right now has very little product because these are all the necklaces that are here. And this is my 14 karat gold station. Usually before this whole table was a 14 karat gold station and I just had marble everywhere and all the earrings were laid out because that's what I'm actually shipping out. But coming here, these necklaces right here, this is all 14 karat gold so I have, these are the 18 inches 14 karat gold, these are the 16 inches, then you have white gold, rose gold, and then of course you have um, the pendants in white gold, yellow gold, rose gold, and oh my god, you haven't seen this, I'm gonna show you this after. Uh, this is actually my newest charm together with another one I'm wearing, I'm gonna show it to you, and I just didn't have this one this last week, but this is so so nice then we're going to move here so what's here so here obviously you guys have seen this before with the shoes let's turn this on each and every one of the orders i have it printed out this makes me double triple and quadruple check what i am sending out making sure i don't send out the wrong thing so right now we are going to work on order 1067 together so we're going to come here ordered 1067 ordered um ear cuff the the ear cuff climber so that's one and they also ordered the yellow gold ear cuff so we cross that out these are the only two things they ordered they also ordered a 
diamond boy necklace, but since we don't have that, we are going to partially fulfill this order. So now that we have here, we're going to go to the next step. Next step is I have already boxed the items that need to be shipped off. I have done a bow by hand. I just love how this detail looks. I feel like I just love unwrapping things that have a bow. And now we're going to put it in the pouch. The third step in the packaging process is the label. And if you guys know and you've bought any of my products before you know that I am very obsessed with details and personalization I just love it everything that I own is personalized to me and I just love how that feels when I receive something that is personalized so I have personalized each and every single one of the labels of each order with um, your name so I make them and then I print them out in a special machine and now I have to cut them by hand and from there you're gonna see the next step Cutting the labels is uh, the most attention intensive part of the entire process because it has to be so precise because if not then I will just mess up the sticker but I really love it because I love everything that I get to do with my hands. So I'm going to show you here. Let me show you the sticker. I want to introduce you to my guillotine, my lovely guillotine that I've had ever since I'm 13 years old and I used to use this when I was selling baby name cards and thank you cards to all the kids in my school and all my neighbors. I used to make these beautiful thank you cards and birthday cards just personalized. I remember I used to use a program called Publisher. I used to print them out in little packages, cut them up here, and I just really refused to get rid of it. So I don't know how many times I've had it fixed. This is what the label says. It says filled with love and 14 karat gold and then Aurelie, which is the name of one of my beautiful girls. She's up in France. And then you have that for Loretta, Aurelie, Sassireka, Melissa, you're in the UK, Melissa, Mariana, Taylin, Sarah, Laura. Okay, these are the last ones. So let's get this shipment done and out of here. Ta-da! I just love this silver bubble mailer. I have been wanting to use this for such a long time, but realistically, I couldn't use it before because you can't package shoes inside of it. But I think it's just so cool, so chic, so it looks so timeless and just classic, but still like super, super cool. I really love it. So Laura, I hope that you really love your earrings. I can't wait to see you wearing them. We'll put the label on it. And from there it comes to the finished packaging stack. I am gonna pop you onto this tripod and I'm gonna set you on a time lapse so I can finish packaging the rest of the packages and we can get this out to the mail today and on to you guys. So let's, let's get cracking.
is the second packaging for larger orders. Here I can fit two, three, up to four boxes and it's basically in yellow gold and I wanted to do the sticker in black and white that way it's very clean and minimalistic and that that you hear in the background is Frank Sinatra because I love Frank Sinatra he just puts me in a really good mood and I'm gonna get demonetized. In other words, I love you. I'm gonna show you the new members of my necklace stack. You're going to be seeing this now all the time. These are two very special pieces to me that I have wanted for a really, really long time. And they are the initials M, one of them in real diamonds and 14 karat gold, and the other one is just in 14 karat solid gold. These necklace, these, these necklaces with this charm is something that I've wanted for a really long time because the way that I think about jewelry is the approach that I have to jewelry is when you think about jewelry, it's probably one of the most affordable things in your closet because if you think about it in terms of cost per wear and the amount of times that you are going to wear it, it really beats anything else. If you own a shirt, you're most likely maybe going to wear that shirt at most once a week and that's if you do that but jewelry is something that you wear every single day another thing that for me is um, vital when i am getting a new piece of jewelry is that the the jewelry is something that dresses up any outfit and jewelry is something that really enhances your mood uh, in that time where maybe you're just wearing something looks plain you throw a couple necklaces on beautiful earrings instantly you just feel more beautiful but having said that one of the things that um you might experience is that you might in, by impulse you might buy a piece of jewelry and then you get buyer's remorse and the way that i approach buying jewelry is that every single piece of jewelry that i buy it has a very deep meaning to me something that you know gives me happy thoughts and reminds me of love it might be you know for example why do i have two m's my diamond m is basically it represents my mother's name maya del carmen and then the small solid gold m it's my name maria teresa so and my boy diamond necklace my mom gave it to me and there's an entire meaning after that so when you are buying a, a new piece of jewelry i would always recommend that you really get something that is meaningful to you it can be you know maybe the initial of your children it can be the initial of your boyfriend or your initials or it might be you know something that you know it's part of a special occasion a lot of you have ordered um charms for your moms that it's going to be their birthdays in a couple months or for a graduation gift or maybe that piece of jewelry is something that reminds you of a trip uh, you know just whenever you buy something when it's jewelry wise you're gonna be wearing it every day and just um really what makes it so special is the fact that it just means something to you and it makes you happy every day when you wear it you know or when you think about it that's how i feel towards necklaces and uh, jewelry in general when it comes to earrings i feel that with earrings, it's a little bit different because earrings is something that I can interchange and also the price of an earring is not really that high. Plus, even though I pretty much wear the same earrings over and over again, it's something that I play a little bit with. So yes, so my new stack now, I want to show it to you and I want to actually, let me grab my laptop. I'm gonna take you to a couple of websites here that I've been looking at the last couple of months. So the first one is Adina's Jewels. You guys probably already know this website. It's very popular and for the diamond initial necklace in 14 karat gold, you're looking at $425. 
$368 just for plain. It's pretty expensive. Then we're going to go to uh, the next one is Majuri. And this is one of the most popular necklaces, the diamond necklace. And I mean, it only has one diamond and it's tiny. This is tiny and it's $300. Uh, then you have the initial necklace, then you have stone and strand, um, you have an in initial necklace in diamonds, that's $325. Uh, then I went to Neiman Marcus and that's $580 for a charm necklace in diamond. Then I was like, okay, let me go to Monica Venadier, let's see if I can find something more economical. And I, she has the initial diamond pendants um the pendant only it's 225 dollars and it's not even 14 karat gold that's sterling silver with a 18 karat gold vermeil which is dipped in gold and um let me see then i went to netta porte and then you again you see the stone and strand um charms in diamonds for 325 so I think the two most compatible here are Adina's Jewels, which has a similar diamond initial necklace for $425, and Majuri, which has the diamond necklace with the one diamond for $300. So then you come over to Spiritual Gloss and you can get the diamond initial necklace with 33 diamonds and 14 characters solid gold you can get it for 287 dollars you can get it in in yellow gold or in white gold and then basically what you do is that you hit personalize it to choose the letter that you want let's say you want a you add it to the cart that way i know that that's the one you want i have personally wanted a diamond initial forever not only i love diamonds and um, they are actually my birthstone but to me the way that a diamond shines it really symbolizes the way that i really try to shine um from the inside not so much from the outside or like putting makeup on or like thinking about my hair that's why you see or like the clothes that i wear yes this is a fashion channel but that's why you guys see that i meditate a lot because with my meditation teacher i am just trying to really build um you know substance with my energy and with my spirituality so i can you know transmit that to people and and touch people without having to really talk to them and give them comfort and just make them feel loved and for me that's why i like diamonds and um for me that's what they represent to me you might call me crazy but that's that's my thing the diamond initials is pretty big it's almost half an inch and actually it comes in white gold and in yellow gold and these ones i love them because they're like chunky and blocked and thick they come also in the solid gold ones they come in white gold and in yellow gold another piece i wanted to show you are my new ear climbers look at them they are incredible they are a lot bigger than the previous ear climbers that i have i have them here i'm going to show them to you actually we're almost sold out on this one there's i only have five of them left you guys bought all of them and i really love this one and this one i had been waiting for and i just received it yesterday these are i mean look at them they are fabulous and i also got a new ear cuff i this ear cuff i love it especially now for summer because it has a lot of different color stones so you have like pastel blue pastel green pink um turquoise and you actually don't need a piercing for this one which i love it so let me put this one on this side so you guys can actually see this better you can tell the difference in sizes here you can see the difference between both ear climbers this one actually is almost sold out i only have five pieces left and this one is the new ear climber and as you can see the stones are bigger and it goes a lot higher up now i'm gonna show you how beautiful this earring is look at this it's inset in 14 karat gold and it 
basically you put it in like this in the ear and then you tighten it up and that's how it stays on this is handmade in italy is exquisite i just want to make very clear that the two initial necklaces both the one in the real diamonds and the one in the solid 14 karat gold and the new ear climber and the new ear cuff are all available in the website right now and they are available for shipping tomorrow i have all these with me right now so you do not have to wait and i actually ordered the what the whole alphabet three times so i have enough of them but i don't have like a lot of them so really take advantage of it the price is super affordable this is something that you're not gonna find in the market and i hope that you guys have enjoyed this vlog on my next video it's going to be a styling video on all the different ways that you can wear t-shirts black and white this summer so make sure that if you like this video you smash that like button and if you're not subscribed it would make me super happy if you've subscribed turn on the notifications bell so you do not miss any of my videos and i see you on my next video this tuesday i send you a big kiss bye